Today we are going to talk about the mentalities that will make you poor. The following are the mentalities that are going to make you poor. If you are new here on my page, consider subscribing below this video. The first one is being poor in spirit. This seems to be you're in a position where you feel like nothing can be done. But don't let those who have failed to bring you down, I'm telling you. There's always something that you can do. There is always a project that you can do. There is always a way. There is a way that things can be done. So don't let anybody pull you down. Don't let losers take you down. Because we believe losers have a low or a poor spiritual belief. I kindly beg you not to accept, not to believe in what the losers believe. That's going to show you a sign of being broke. That is a sign of being poor. The mentality, the spirit of being low, being poor. You're always in the corners. Things will not work out. Things can't do. But I'm reminding you, grow a spiritual belief that things can be done. other mentality is being poor in love let's be so clear on this one it's important to love yourself but being poor in love makes you lose confidence if you like you have self hurt you feel like you hate whatever goes on you feel like you no longer understand whatever is happening in the world this is a greater sign of being poor. It's a mentality that's going to keep you remain poor for the rest of the days. And I, the best I can say is try to love yourself. Nobody else will love you if you can't love yourself. Try to put the strength that comes with love. This is going to heal you. This is going to open for you a new world. It's going to drive you from, drive you from being a broke person to growing from one step to another till you succeed and become a rich person. The spirit of being poor in love is very dangerous cause there is nothing you can do. You feel like every time you're lazy, nobody cares about you, you don't care about whatever happens. You feel offended, so weak, something which is always negative. But simply, you learn slowly, time over time, start with self-loving. This is going to heal all the pains in you. Poor in habits. This is a bad mentality. A bad character that shows you are poor in eating habits, saving habits, dressing habits because these tend to demolish these tend to wash away these tend to bring lots of negative issues into your life decide one day to be focused rather than to remain lazy fill your days with procrastinations build your habits into routines and decide to ignore those who wish to join you in those bad characters. What I can say, try to improve on your habits, learn only the positive ones. Because the moment you decide to remain in the negative habits, you are going to be so, so poor, so back, back, backward. It's going to keep you backward. You have poor saving habits, financially will be struggling. You have poor eating habits, your health will be in big shit. I would recommend you to work on your habits, improve step by step, then the others will follow. But first look at the habits, the normal, normal in the habits, the eating habits, the dressing habits, saving habits, how you handle things, the rest shall come over time and success 
awaits for you when you improve on your habits. Poor in the attitude. Do you have an idea how being poor in the attitude is a mentality of being broke? A mentality of being poor? For example, if you always think about negativity, how then will you do something which is so productive? How will you think of producing something that is demanded in the market? How will you then think of delivering a service? How then will you think of anything positive? The only way you can do is to surround yourself with strong people full of positivity. If you associate with people who are filled with negativity, it will rub off you and slow you down. Even putting others off from talking to you about their aspirations. Make sure you surround yourself with positive people, open-minded people so that you can pick up the attitude, the motivation, and drive your life to success. Being poor in wisdom. This is a terrible situation, if at all. Wisdom-wise, you are so poor. How, how then will you change your life if your wisdom can't stand by you? Be alert in any situation. To have a depth to your personal and aiding, and aiding others. This is going to help you change your life. Because being knowledgeable is success is a greater key to success. And having richness in the character can as well change you. Because your, your character of being rich will allow you to create a new opportunity for your life and for yourself. Try your best to be so wise. Create an environment of wisdom. Take time. Read books. Take time. Do researches. Take time. Read the newspapers. Be on the internet and understand new things. This is going to impact on your wisdom. This is going to change your character. This is going to change you from being a broke person. Being poor in finance is the seventh mentality. The mentality that you are going to be so poor remain broke for the rest of the days. And here being poor in finance are meaning you are so lazy in saving, you are so lazy in making money, you are not smart at all in issues relating to money. However, this is what I can advise to you. Make sure you are smart in terms of money. Make sure you develop good saving habits. Learn how to invest your money. This leads to a positive outlook of your whole life. This changes you from being broke, from being poor, to attaining success and becoming great. I would advise you to look into the financial habits. Learn how to save. Learn how to invest. Learn the habits of money. Then you're going to remain successful. And if not all oh, those points we have talked about, if you don't improve on those points, I'm telling you, you're going to remain broke, you're going to remain poor and so miserable. Look into the points, the mentality that show this one is broke. Work upon them, one by one. Work upon them, you're going to improve yourself your whole life. And become successful and become rich, because the moment you attain success, we mentally believe that success deals with somebody being rich. If you're new on my channel, please subscribe for more motivations, more lessons about money, entertainment, because I'm always uploading two videos in a week. Click on the subscription and let me know.